All right, everybody. I'm at a show, and I figured, let's build a guitar. Day one, got a couple of beautiful things with me. <laughs> Bane in my life, those two. Yeah, it's sort of a, a cross between guitar show and woodworking show. I'm here, I'm gonna be doing a couple of talks about uh, sharpening tools and the like. And uh, in the rest of my time, I figured I'm gonna to put together a, a, one of our kit guitars and try and do something a little bit more interesting. When April Wilkerson visited our workshops to build a guitar back in May, she introduced me to Isotunes and I have been wearing a pair ever since. They are incredible ear defenders and Bluetooth headphones. If you use the code CRIMSON10, you will get 10 pounds off your own set. And uh, you should, because they're amazing. I brought a few tools with me. That's a box of sharpening stuff, bits and pieces. Fritz. I'm wondering what I've forgotten. That's going to be the uh, that's going to be the thing. And this box, this box is where it's at. So we don't normally ship kits out with all of the hardware required, but uh, this time, well, they even stapled it. Uh, I uh, I asked the lads to make an exception for me, and uh, well, I have all sorts. Okay, so I should have everything. That's a top, no, that's a rear mount bridge. Oh, that's a top mount bridge. That's giving me, uh, I don't particularly want to uh, drill by hand with a hand drill, uh, string ferrules, etc. because uh, frankly, my testicles are not large enough. I've just realized the first thing I forgot. Something soft to put the guitar on. Uh, good thing we got bubble wrap. Oh, look at that. Ah, oh, that's perfect. So, what should we do? The doors are just about to open now. I'm thinking racing stripe. Racing stripes? And just one offset. And I'm limited in what I can do here. I brought a few tools, but guaranteed there's gonna be something I've lost or missed or don't have and can't borrow. The real question is, do I just carve this one? Do I change the shape? Do I bandsaw it? Do I cut it up into a million pieces and glue it back together? Do I have enough time? This is a three day show. Uh, been open 10 minutes and there's only a couple of people up here so far, but we're on the third floor. It takes a while to percolate through. There are gonna be, well, it's gonna be full. With lots of talking. So the options I have are, Go totally crazy. Chop this into a multitude of pieces. Glue it back together again and you've got some sort of a, some sort of a aircraft type thing. Or a ruler. Fine, there's a straight edge. There we go. I like the idea of a, just a simple pinstripe. Yeah, I'll make sure this for, the, for the, the side effect of a guitar being created. So the plan is I'm going to do this carve. I'm going to put a belly carve in the other side with a, probably with a spoke shave actually. Doing everything by hand. And uh, then I want to carve in a 
a racing stripe, but with relief carved pattern. Um, that should just be fairly subtle, maybe. I didn't do subtle very well. Yeah, she's completely, uh, completely playable. So the plan is to take it down fairly Something like that, so I want that nice and thin. Yeah, well, I could quite happily go on with a gouge. Ah, there we go. The problem is, that's going to piss off a lot of people. So, uh, yeah, I'll just go. Uh, that's going against the grain, but it's, it's not too much of an issue at the moment. But you know, you know, the, the joy of using a sharp tool. <laughs> yes, it's a gorgeous joint, isn't it? So this is one of our standard kit guitars. Uh, we do a, a Telecaster, a Strat, a Les Paul, and a PRS type. Although we don't call them that because of uh, legal, legal, legal reasons. Um, but the guys that make the kits are the same guys that make our production guitars. You know, there's a two grand guitar over there. Uh, or you can buy the, the, the building blocks of one for three or four hundred quid. Um, and then yeah, do whatever you want. That's blunt. Day two of three, the, uh, the fire alarm in the hotel thought it was a good idea to go off at about half past midnight for no reason and kept on going off intermittently for an hour. <coughs> it's build a guitar. Okay, I am well rested, I'm good to go. And here we are. I'm, I'm very happy with the carve, the curve, the comfort curve, all that jazz. Uh, I might, it depends on whether I want to bolt this on or, or glue it in. I might carve away this heel. I will carve away this heel. I have no choice, that's just uncomfortable. Um, uh, but, what I'm going to do now is a racing stripe. This is going to take some time because ow, because I'm doing it with this beautiful tool. I've just moved, I, I did want it parallel to the neck and actually going right up to the neck, but it's going through the pickups and underneath the bridge. Going through the pickups is fine when it's that much of the pickup, but when it's only just touching the corner, it looks unintentional. So now I'm going to move it completely off. So it's not touching that, not to, and it just looks more intentional. Uh, this is only the fifth or sixth time or eighth time I've drawn this line. <laughs> Thank you.
using that, Hi, mate. Why are you using that? This is what you need. Beautiful. Oh, Bessie wood handled knife. <laughs> Man. <laughs> so, the ones that we've got are the, um, uh, they're, they're not the wooden handles, are they? And it's the same as the plastic ones? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Beautiful. Now that is a little bit better. I think putting out, uh, you know, I'm going to do a series of guitars, taking a kick guitar and making it Star Wars, taking a kick guitar and making it steampunk, etc. Okay. Yeah. So I'll still be doing some crazy stuff, but uh, I also want to do some guitars that are just understated and beautiful. And because uh, really that's the sort of guitars that I like looking at. Um, and yeah, the 90 hour and all that, it's a test of what I can do. Yeah. And it's sort of half showing off and it's half about getting views and, and, and all of that, which is, are all valid. But I don't want to be known as the guy that makes the crazy guitars. <laughs> I want to be known as the guy who can make guitars, whether they're crazy or not. Day three, just before everything comes on, just before the people get in. And, uh, well, I've got to finish building this guitar today, don't I? Mm -hmm.
Thank you for watching. Don't forget to use the code CRIMSON10 to get £10 off your own pair of Isotunes. They're amazing. I love them. So forget.